Hello and welcome to uh, Tawani's Pilgrim's TLP edition. We're uh, going to do the monk epic today. And uh, we're here in Iridan where the quest starts. Uh, typically this guy is located right here in the center of the library. But for some reason he's right here. And uh, we're going to go with that. So let's go and hail him. And he says, Good day, citizen. Please remember to keep your voice down in our library. Feel free to browse the extensive collection of books we have on display. Learning is all about you. Our library is the greatest collection of educational literature in the world. As you can see, no doubt, if you've come across rare finds, we may be interested in purchasing them. Rare finds, you say? Yes, any rare books, tomes, essays... Or any other literature you may find be, be of interest to me. Although the finds I am interested in are quite high profile. And would most likely be only found in possession of very powerful or influential beings. Give me what you found and I will pay you what it's worth. Alright, so we are going to give him the... Uh, where'd I put it? So much junk in my bag. The Immortals, right here. This is from Skyfire. I got it while farming pearls on my cleric. Ah, uh, there we go. And we give him that. Let's see, he gasps at the sight of this rare book and says, This is a great find indeed. I can only imagine who had, who you had to persuade to give it to you. Our library would be very interested in acquiring this. I am prepared to give you this platinum and a referral that marks you as a friend of the library. If only Le Helio <laughs> could see this. Let's say, let's say that. Oh, we got 12 platinum for that. Uh, so he was my predecessor here at the library of Iridan. He has since retired just a few years ago. I am sure he would be most impressed with your find and an insightful conversation on the subject although i'm not sure one of your your profession would be interested in such a scholarly endeavor no offense if you were interested find him and tell him you found the book the immortals i'm not sure where he was retired to i hear it is on an ocean somewhere all right so we need now to go to uh Timorous deep and uh talk to the guy there so let's go ahead and head there and for the next stage all right we are here in uh timorous deep right uh down here in this secret little island where the druid and cleric epic place take place and we're at here at uh, leo right here so let's go and hail him jumps at your voice and begins to begins laughing <laughs> at his skittishness he says ah hello there not many people know of this place, so visitors are quite rare. <laughs> it is a very beautiful place indeed, so um, please don't go telling everyone you know about it. <laughs> Thanks, friend. Alright, now we need to tell him that we found the Book of Immortals. Looks up at you, eyes wide in astonishment, and says, Oh my god, you found Immortals. Where did you find it? Never mind, it is unimportant. I have in my possession a book that explains more about these individuals. Its value is unimaginable, as well as its impact it is capable of. As you can see, I grow old and I need an individual to watch over this book and make sure it is protected. Would you be willing to take on this responsibility? I will. I will take on the responsibility. I'm sorry, Tawani, but I could only give this book to a true master, such as a member of the Whistling Fist Order, unless you can give me proof that you are one, in addition to Daniel's reference, which is very unlikely. There is no way I'll let you take charge of the Celestial Fists. The Celestial Fist is the title of a book written by an unknown author. His writing is subpar, but the legend is interesting from a biographical standpoint alone. It is a rarity common, commands top dollar in the scholarly, scholarly community. But the secrets revealed in the book are what truly makes it dangerous. I thought of many times to destroy it, but just couldn't. I hope you're able to find someone to watch over it soon. All right, so we need to hand over 
our robe of the whistling fist and our reference here like so there we go now we get the book celestial fist let's go ahead and put it right there and he's an instant respawn so it's good to know if you're doing this quest all right so he said astonishing to think that you are a master of an order thought to be lost in our world forgive my earlier doubts i believe you are indeed worthy to be given the responsibility of watching over this book take great care and making sure it does not fall into the wrong hands as it would truly be disastrous all right uh, let's see if the book says anything all right, all right i guess you can't click it and an eligible tome of immense power i guess you can't even read it either <laughs> All right, so now we need to go to uh, Trachanon's Teeth and talk to Karen. So we're going to head there. All right, so this quest is kind of jacked up, I guess. Uh, but here he is in the middle of the zone. He usually spawns here or here, but he's spawned right there. So I don't even know which version this is, so let's hail him. This is the mad version, so we need to give him the book and he will spawn another one. Uh, let me move my guys over here. All right, if you say what celestial fist to him, he freaks out and he goes, eh, what's that? Baha, that was destroyed long ago. Don't waste my time with fairy. I get it away. They're all over me. And then we hand the book over to him. Celestial fist. Which now he gives us back a book, the celestial fist. And we can't open this one. Does it still intelligible? All right, so now we hand that book to him. And we have to go over to his other spawn right over here and uh, talk to that version. All right, here's the other form of him. Let's go ahead and hail him here. Does not respond to hail. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna hand him this book. Where did you get this? And then we say, I got it from, yo, mm, never heard of him. Well, it doesn't matter. The book is here now. Curse that idiot for writing it in the first place. Not even sure why I let him stick around. If you ever see that clown monk, Erdo, kick him in the shin, <laughs> shins for me. At any rate, I suppose you'd have to find the fist and have a nice chat with them. Uh, their master owes me much. I will reward you well if you bring me proof of the master's defeat. Have a chat with them. As I suppose it would, all the children are looking for uh, fame and glory. will eventually learn the poison of ambition, but you will find... Well, will you find them? They will... They are able to meld their elements seamlessly. They are certainly have no interest in fooling with the likes of you. No, you will need to get their attention. Fortunately, I know how you can do this. How can I do this? There we go. How can I do this? Not how can you do this? My guess is that their weakness is the fist with the easiest to draw. He is an egotistical and arrogant. How he came to the master of discipline of fire, I do not know. He will most likely be in another form, one of his elements. When you find... When you find one believed to be the fist, you must challenge him. Is I will uh, if you use his true name, Ejij, in your formal challenge, he will respond. A flame can burn intensely, but it cannot last for long. Know this when you battle him. All right, and then this goes into uh, the the following videos that I'm gonna have, uh, where we go fight uh, Ejag. Uh, uh, what is it? The presence in the air, the, the, tra, da, 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 the sleeping ogre, Trunt, and, uh, I think that's it. <laughs> and then we go fight the final boss. All right. For the next part of the monk epic, we have to kill Guan in the plain of sky. So kind of position I'm on the warrior, so I can actually do this without having any issues. 
Uh, so there's the monk right there, Tawani. She's going to give the item to the presence, and he's going to spawn, and then I'm going to run the presence, uh, the Guan, inside of here. So that's what's going to happen. And uh, we hand in the charred uh, scale to him. All right, there he is. For simplicity, I'm going to go defensive so I don't have to pay attention as much. There we go. We got the monk going. Got the bard going. We're going to try to snare him. With the druid, we're going to send the necro pet in. I got uh, I got Stasi here. I got Voxel. I got my bard. It's a all around full time. It looks like this guy might be 100% magic resist, so <laughs> I don't think anything's going to land on him since nothing landed on him yet. Let me try a different dot on Voxel. And I do have my cleric, Emmy, and that's the knockback uh, that you want to be aware of. It will knock you off the island. Uh, I, I don't think on live I've ever had him last long enough to even matter. Uh, but... Does not look like anything is landing on him. I'm try Poison Bolt or uh, and Venom Bolt. I'm going to drop Complete Heal. He is, I don't know how if he's hitting that hard or not, but... Oh, we landed the Druid Dot, so whatever that is, is landing. But nothing else is landing. So the Druid Dots must have like some super uh, negative mag magic resist uh, fire on them. Let's try a fire nuke. Let's see if that does anything. Druids are OP, if you ask me. That didn't land out. Okay, now he's running like a little whiner, and this is terrible because now he's outside. The problem we have right now is that we could aggro the other islands and uh, cause issues, but here, uh, he's on the outside of the thing. I'm just beating him right now. The, the pet's out here beating him. I got the monk out here. Him. He's right by the door. He's about to. There we go. He died uh, right there. So the Breath of Guan goes to Tawani, and that part of the quest is done. All right, the next part of this quest is going to be in uh, uh, Nurga, and it does not look like there's any text, any, 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 like, any writing involved in this. I don't know how it was discovered or anything like that. I haven't figured that out yet, but we'll tie it all together when we're done with the video. But next uh, kill is in Nurga. All right, we're here in Nurga and we're ready for the next part. So what we need to do is get on the monk and turn in the breath have to be sneak behind the sleeping ogre right in front of me all right the ogre cons indifferently gonna hand in the breath of guan go there's trunt let's go ahead and pull him got him with the warrior and i think I'll, i'm just gonna go defensive Stand behind him there we go. All right, snare, necro. Same group as the last thing. Literally just came here from sky. And looking good. Did not land anything on him there. Let's see if splurt will land. Oh, splurt didn't land. Does druid, uh, druid, what you call it, land? Druid stuff lands on everything. <laughs> I don't know what it is about that. Uh, but that is pretty crazy. All right, so this guy's going down pretty easy. Uh, we are all... I'm I'm 60. My uh, two uh, Voxel and Stasi, they're 53 and 54. The other four are 60. All right, let's get a complete heal on me just in case. I mean, he hits up to 200 with defensive on, so he might be a little rough. I'm kind of, I'm kind of geared. Uh, I am, I, I am a raid tank. I do have like uh, some good stuff, so that could be something to keep in mind. 
Alright, well, I guess, uh... Druid damage is the only thing that's gonna land on this thing. And he runs, of course. One thing I'm not good at multi-boxing yet is chasing mobs. That run. Alright, there we go. I can get the right mouses. <laughs> uh, it doesn't help that the bard is, uh... Playing that speed song. Uh, he should die here in a second. This is so much work to uh, move. All right, there we go. Uh, the trunt's head goes to uh, Tawani. There we go. And we're done with this part. Uh, the next part, we need to take the head of trunt and give it to an astral projection in over there. Easy enough. So that's where we're headed next for the next part of the monk epic and something i did not see when we uh, handed the head in he the sleeping ogre says your path of wat and destruction ends here tawani guan and ej eeg jag were impatient and hot-headed you will not defeat me for i have the patience and perseverance of stone unlike the children you have beaten before me are you sure you want to challenge me tawani and uh that's what he said so <laughs> there we go all right well now here in over there uh right here in the little pit next to howling stone it's unmarked on the map ours uh, the astral projection and we're gonna hand trunt's head the head we looted from trunt not too long ago to the astral projection which then we get an eye of karen back and he says the astral production looks up at Tawani and up and down and says, I was hoping for something more impressive. This is just a small token of the last person who tried to interfere with my plans. He failed as you shall. But tell me truly, are you the one who has rudely removed my students? And then uh, there we go. We get the next part. And now we need to give the... I to somebody in Lake Omen to spawn the next mob. So uh, we're almost done with this part of the uh, Monk Epic. Awesome. All right, so all the boss fights are done and we're ready to turn this in. So we're going to turn in the Book of Celestial Fists along with the Demon Fangs from the final fight. And bam, we get Celestial Fist is a significant over upgrade over my uh, fear gloves and uh, there we go here is the final uh, monk epic item right here uh, 15 AC uh, 20 strength 10 stamina 10 agility 10 all resists and we get a clicky buff which is celestial tranquility which increases our attack attack speed and armor class so I don't know what that went up to it's pretty crazy yeah wow 176 so definitely uh, a premium weapon here uh, definitely a very nice but uh, that is the monk epic hopefully this gets edited together correctly in all the right places uh, there's a few other steps we could have done uh, but they weren't necessary and we just wanted to finish the epic truth be told <laughs> there we go uh, 100 hp too so that's just like a phenomenal weapon hopefully this increases my uh, dps on fights on the raids as a box character but uh there we go tawani's monk epic is uh complete on the tlp version i'll probably go back and do it again on the uh Ferona Vi version but Thank you guys very much for watching, and I hope that you have a fantastic day.